fuck with this man. You talk about rigor mortis. Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. R.K. has been watching over me for years now. He says he's not too sure about you yet, though. All right, well, Gunmar has sent me after we have uh, cleaned up his vampire business. I says you got something. I once killed 30 vampires with my bare hands, you know. Ask R.K., he'll tell you. Right. So, what can I do to help? I've been poring over some of the tomes left here in the keep. Interesting stories, indeed. Seems mm -hmm. the previous incarnation of the Dawn Guard had, at one time, some interesting toys. Arke and I think it could be a great advantage for us. You should look into retrieving it. Okay, so what is this artifact? An axe imbued with magic, fueled by the destruction of the unholy. Mm. With every victorious blow against an undead creature, its power grows. Arke warns its baneful charge abates with each dawn. Something to keep in mind, I suppose. All right, so any idea what I'll be up against? What's that, Lord? Well, should I tell him? Vampires, perhaps. What? Nothing you can't handle. All right, understood. Go with the light. Certainly will. All right, Kaiden. Come on. Divine smile on you, friend. Vampires. Can't wait. This wouldn't be the first time that I've traveled with a wanted criminal, but I think we should get that bounty taken care of. Hmm. I didn't realize I had a bounty. Thanks for letting me know. All right, it's over here somewhere. Here it is, Mara's Eye Pond. Uh oh, what? There's just no bloody end to us, is there? It's a mud crab. Oh, there's more. And let Stendar's aura take care of it. Yes! Since the evening light. Alright. Oh, another Fight. mud crab. Okay, I got it. Well, the aura did. Oh, look, there's a ice claw here. All right, here we go. Be ready. What was that? There they are. Just two vampires. It's really disappointing. Let's see. Cloak of magic suppression. And twenty percent is a lot though. Alright, check around. Let's see what's here. Killed a man.
take these robes of destruction, these cards, and here it is. The Rune Axe. chest. Look at this. Hylian Elden Armor. Target is 40% weaker to frost damage. Grants 40% resistance to fire. Grants 40% re resistance to shock. Wow, that's nice. A jade relic. A scrawled note. I cannot decipher this. Is it even encoded? Whatever. Okay. See somebody put a coin purse way up there. Got it. All right, let's get out of here. Resisted the axe. That's interesting. Uh, what? Who is this? Oh, look out. It's an ogre. Look out. using silver bolts on this thing. Oh no, I should have checked and saved those for the vampires. Alright. Thanks for nothing, Caden. Looks like you could have helped out. 
Let's go. Listen, I can hear you. You've got a really foul mouth, Caden. I don't think this is going to work out. I'm going to have to dismiss you as a follow-up. What happened before? When you looked at that word wall, it was like you fell into a, a trance. Don't try to talk me out of it. I'm at your service. All right, we should part ways. I see. Maybe our paths will cross again. Maybe not. If you need to find me, stop by the dead man's drink in Falkreath. All right. Farewell. Flow on back. Arcade, I once killed 30 vampires with my bare hands, you know. I've retrieved the Dawn Guard Runex from Marazapan. Well done. I said you'd return victorious. Arcade wasn't so sure. Yeah, yeah. Wielded bravely. All right, well, good. You don't have anything else for me to ask for help about. We'll speak again soon. Yeah. I think it might be time for us to. Move on with attacking the vampires. Let's see where's uh Hope you're getting along with Isron. He takes some getting used to. Yeah, yeah. Do you know where There's he a is? Place, isn't this? Divine smile on you, friend. <laughs> Well, I suppose I can test out these new Dawn Guard toys with this assignment that I have neglected. Now that I have all three of them, the axe, the hammer, the shield, see what we have up here. I need to find out more information about the ancient vampire remains that I found. All right, the subject has revealed under torture. I guess uh, somebody brought a vampire in here for torture. About the whereabouts of five relics of vampires the vampires, okay, let's just start over. The subject has revealed under torture the whereabouts of five relics the vampires believe can imbue their kind with additional abilities, making them particularly destructive to mortals. These relics are said to be remains of ancient vampires with rituals intended to utilize ancient blood to enhance vampiric abilities planned. It is well known that the vampire bloodlines convey a vast variety of supernatural abilities. Similarly, vampires have always believed that the most ancient of those bloodlines convey more power than younger bloodlines. Our records show numerous wars between vampire clans that ended with the victors consuming, quite literally, the defeated. Some were even waged for this express purpose. It is difficult to determine whether the victorious clans truly grew stronger from the cannibalism. However, if there is any chance these remains do contain the capacity for enhancement of vampiric abilities, it is in the best interest of mankind that they be obtained by any means possible and subsequently destroyed. Stendar willing, placing them into the fire at his beacon will be sufficient to destroy them. 
Otherwise, we're going to need to dig a really deep hole. Per the subject, the remains and their whereabouts are as follows. Mummified vampiric arm, hand attached, in the keeping of a small clan at Broken Fang Cave. Mummified hands recently unearthed in a particularly partially, in a, in a partially collapsed ruin west of Rorik's dead. Mummified head in the possession of the clan at Bloodlet Throne, believed to be linked to Falkreath Jarl, Falkreath Jarl or his ancestors. That would be Vighar. Mummified rib cage worshipped and maintained by a clan operating at a den in the vicinity of Clear Pine Cl Pond in the hills above Dragon Bridge. Mummified vampiric leg possessed by a clan operating somewhere within Hal March. All right. Well, I don't see the vampire that was tortured unless these are the bones but I uh, see what we can do with this information so basically it's finding these items and before the vampires do and they can increase their power well I think that's for another day and look at this look who's in here sleeping Father, I wish you would practice what you preach, but then, if you never slept, you truly would be running around here like a madman. All right, well, I don't have any companions right now because of the, the foul mouth Kaiden companion that was with me. But anyhow, he was dismissed. I just need to find something to do to bide my time just for a little while longer before I go after the third and final Elder Scroll. All right, well, somehow I ended up here at the Bloodlet Throne. attacked or threatened by these creatures. But he just ran. together, making it hard for me to attack. Somebody helping me. Okay. Well, I 
combat skills are still still top notch. All right, here we are, Bloodlet Throne. We cleared this of vampire, so I guess I should just expect more. Come on up here, stupid vampire. Hmm, Stendar's aura quickly dispatched the vampire. Good to know that sunlight, holy energy, can take out these vampires. Right, let me switch to the rune axe so that it can charge up. Someone's shooting arrows. Wait, I wanted to grab these septums if I could. Let's deal with these vampires. Now let's finish this. Yes, let's. <laughs> Feel the might of Stendar's aura. Dwarven katana. 
Was this dead? It is this way. Couldn't really tell. I think this is where the vampire was that was shooting the arrows. Or the thrall boy. I remember this. I'm having flashbacks. To where things didn't go so good until I turned into a werewolf. Let's see how things are now. Hello? Oh, so you... Maybe the hounds need to feel a taste of Stendhal's aura. And you? There. Who's next? Is there anyone that was gonna face me? Is there anyone that can? I'm warning you, back off. <laughs> You're warning me. Alright, I'll face you without the aura. Well, <laughs> sorry. You triggered it. No more. I yield. Now you yield. All right, here it is the ancient vampire head. So I wonder if these actually must be disposed of absolutely at Stendar's Beacon, or can I put them on display in the, the museum? of blessings. Alright, I already know that, but I can sell it.
All right, I did it single-handedly. And didn't have to turn, change into a werewolf. I'm truly ready now. I suppose another test could be in order here at Broken Fang Cave. I think I came here and had to run out many months ago before I had the power and the skill and the training that I have now. All right, let's see what's inside. Additional enchantment to this axe is these flares of light. They weren't mentioned in the description or the lore. Here it is, Ancient Vampire Arm. Take that. Oh, this is new. Armor rating increased by 12%. The Necklace of Constellations. Alrighty, Dispel Magic. Pure Astral Bite. Requires a bolt of Aetherius Energy. Huh. I'll stick with the uh, fire and divine light. Hmm, who was this? Was this the voice I heard? I'll take the soul gem and the petty soul gem. And I know the enchantment on that, so let me go ahead and learn this Necklace of Constellations and the Steel Dagger of Clay. There. One day I'm going to be able to do my own enchanting and not have to go to C Caselmo. Right, looks like we've got everything. Well, we might as well knock out all of these. I say we, I, might as well knock out all of these while I'm on a roll. Looks like I'm gonna be unstoppable when it comes to vampire killing. All right, and I'm back at Morvoth's lair. Movoth's lair. Let's see what's inside. It's like I'm making a, a grand tour of all the vampire lairs. Oh, is this what that? I remember that spider spit poison in my face the last time. Come on, let's see what you made of. Oh, 
Oh, let's see what you're made of. I'd gather not much. Never should have come here. Shouldn't I have? You're gonna die. For that. Am I? Not quite oh, you, you hit a bit hard there. Enough, though. Hello, everyone. I was certainly too overconfident here. Did you hear something? Let me do this Hello? the easier way, I hope. Ah! Oh, these vampires are a lot stronger, it seems. Cannot withstand the light. If I could just. If you could just what? Go on, tell me what. And your vampire buddy over here. The light of Stendar burned her out. Let's see, was there anything else in here that I need to take? You can't hide from me. Oh, I'm not hiding. Come and find me. Nobody here now. Over here. Mm. Uh oh, this is a a powerful vampire. I'll, I'll kill you. Welcome to try. But you're not you're not doing a good job of it. There you go. Oh, look at this night sword. Enough. 
There you go. Uh oh, I think the, uh, oh, here it is. The vampire leg. I thought it might have gotten stuck behind the, uh, bookcase, but we've got it. Elven Claws of Ice Blast. Well, they're worth something. Take the Vala Stones. Paladin Armor, look at the value. Wow. All right, that was quite the fight. block I'm not getting that uh, holy aura with the shield oh well guess you can't have everything all right let me oh somebody else hello up already. Come on. Oh, it's too bad. Couldn't withstand the light. Let's go down here and get this chest too while I'm here. We have one more stop. All right, Pine Moon Cave for the rib cage. Confident, even with divine abilities. Is someone there? Yes, someone's <gasps> here. I guess it just goes to show that some vampires are stronger than others. Because these were certainly weak. Oh, look at this. Claim Pine Moon Cave. What banner will you raise? So this doesn't seem to work. Scroll of King's Heart. Oh, this is nice. When it is nearby, it fortifies most skills. Nice. What's under here? Okay, I've read that. So here it is. 
vampire rib cage. I think there was a uh, chest back here. those things that Orion wanted. Alright, I don't think there's much else in here. Just... Just glance over. Oh, look at this man. You talk about rigor mortis. Okay, so... I'm off to Stendar's Beacon. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. All these bears. in life. What is all this? Abba Molotov. I think, isn't this alien architecture? All right, well, anyway, we'll worry about that another time. Let's get up here to Stendar's Beacon. Oh, hello, guard. Look at that holy fire. That must be for the vampire parts. Here we are. What? Is this a vampire? Wait, no. This is the Vigilant. They're dead. What happened here? It's another one. Is there some creature up here? No. Look at all these guards. What's going on up here? Hello? Take my advice. Don't listen to that talk of a face sculptor down in the ragged flagon. If you journey north, face keep butcher well away from is more likely from cave. what I've heard. Damned hag ravens have infested the place. What is this? The guild used to run this city. Is it is this a gossip party? What's going on here? Death down in their rat way. A garnet sunberg egg. Uh, in fact, just trinkets that may or may not be an exact representation of a real sunbird egg. Since no one knows if sunbirds actually lay eggs or what sunbirds are. For that matter. Funny. That's very funny. Okay, can I dispose of these things? Yes. There we go. All right, well, I'm sorry. I Dad, think this was the better choice. 
to destroy them rather than display them. I mean, should somebody manage to get a hold of those things in the museum? Some vampire. That could really spell bad news for Tamriel. All right. Let me get back to Fort Dawn Guard and start our plans for getting the last Elder Scroll.